Volkswagen's new boss is under pressure to explain claims by US regulators that they found more cars equipped to cheat emissions tests. What's more, they include the Porsche brand previously run by Matthias Müller. The US Environmental Protection Agency says the software was installed in three-litre diesel engines, mostly in Porsche and Audi models. VW has denied the claims. Yeah, I'm, uh, this car industry analyst says VW's position is that they've put everything known so far on the table and there are no further models affected. If that's true, we must say that's OK. But if the EPA is right here and even the premium brands Audi and Porsche are affected, then we must say that Volkswagen's crisis management is still not good. Uh, nach wie vor nicht gut. The regulator says the latest inquiry concerns at least 10,000 vehicles sold in the US. VW has previously admitted installing so-called defeat devices in 11 million cars worldwide. Reacting to the latest allegations, Chancellor Merkel said, Made in Germany remains thanks to innovation, a trademark and a seal of quality, and the events at Volkswagen change nothing on that score. I want to stress that again. But they also show that we must insist here on transparency and a quick clean-up. Reports say VW's supervisory board is to meet next week to consider the scandal. The 6.7 billion euros set aside to make amends have already hit the carmaker in the pocket.